Luke chapter 17. Luke chapter 17. Amen. And we're going to be reading verses 11 through 19. Luke chapter 17, verses 11 through 19. Very familiar passage of scripture. And it reads, And it came to pass, as he went to Jerusalem, that he passed through the midst of Samaria and Galilee. And That's the test. And as they entered into battery. Take that into the battery for Get Rico man. Devil is alive. We're going to do this. Praise God. There we go. Thank you, Rico. Amen. Amen. I think the devil followed me to church this morning because he was with me all week. Whatever could go wrong at work went wrong. Amen. Amen. Can I get a little bit more volume on this mic? Here we go. Um, Luke chapter 17, verse 11, it says again, And it came to pass, as he went to Jerusalem, that he passed through the midst of Samaria and Galilee. And as he entered into a certain village, there met him ten men that were lepers, which stood afar off. And they lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. Yes. And when he saw them, he said unto them, Go, show thyselves unto the priest. Yes, sir. And it came to pass that as they went, they were cleansed. Amen. Amen. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, turned back and with a loud voice glorified God. Amen. And fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks. And he was a Samaritan. And Jesus answered and said this, Were there not ten cleansed? Where are the nine? Yes. There are not found that return to give glory to God, save this stranger. Amen. Amen. And he said unto him, Arise, mm -hmm. go thy way. Thy faith has made thee whole. Amen. Amen. With our point of emphasis on verse 16, the key verse. And they fell down on his face and his feet, giving him thanks. Yes, Amen. You may be seated. Thank you, Pastor Gibber, for this preaching privilege and opportunity. We made it. Yes, sir. We made it. Amen. That's not the title, but we made it. Yes, Our church has been closed physically for 20 months and one week. We have endured some times that we've never seen before. These are perilous times. Yes. Yes. Hate groups and racism has skyrocketed. Yes. The rains and sick men have tried to overthrow our government back in January of this year. Our country has never been divided like it is today. The history of the history books are being rewritten trying to conceal slavery. Voting rights are being violated. The wealth gap continues to spread. Black on black crime soars. Police brutality increases. Businesses and schools have closed. And then on a personal note, we all have some type of pain. We're dealing with some kind of loss. Yes. 
Yes, sir. We're burning down. We've dealt with death, disappointment, cabin fever, and trouble on every end. Just this pandemic alone Amen. has taken over 500 million people throughout this world. And some of us in this room have caught the virus and has been delivered from it. Amen. And on top of everything that I mentioned, we survived the Trump administration. Amen. Amen. My question to you today is, are you thankful? All right. Yes. Amen. All right. Are you thankful? Amen. Yeah. Are you thankful? Thank you, Lord. Yes. You see, you're not that special. Amen. <laughs> you're not that handsome. Yes, you're not sir. that pretty, you're yes, not sir. that sharp, you're not that healthy. Yes, sir. The reason why you are here today Preach. is because God kept you. Yes, 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 sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. God kept a hedge of protection around you. Yes, sir. Thank you. And I don't know about you, but that's something to praise him about. Amen. Amen. Are you thankful this morning? Yes, Lord. Some of us have been on vacation. Yes, sir. And have made it back safely. Amen. 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 Some of us have to go to work every day. Yeah. Dealing with these COVID patients. Dealing with people who choose not to get vaccinated. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Dealing with people who choose not to wear a mask. Amen. Right. Amen. You go to Kroger's. Yes, sir. You're not wearing masks. Amen. All right. Amen. All right. You go to Home Depot, they're not wearing masks. Amen. Are you thankful that God kept you this morning? Amen. Because it ain't the mask. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Doc. Yes, sir, Doc. Amen. Not the Amen. 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 Verse 11 says this, and as it came to pass that as he went to Jerusalem, that he passed through the midst of Samaria yes, sir. and Galilee. And so as Jesus was busy heading to uh, Jerusalem, um, he was interrupted. Why? Because he had encountered ten lepers. Leprosy. A fatal disease, a contagious disease had affected these ten individuals. Leprosy Cause someone to develop boils and sores on their body. Yes, and because of the sores, their body would lose circulation to certain points. And those limbs would rot off. Right. And die. They were contagious. They were outcasts. They were not. They were not allowed to come to church. Right. Right. Amen. They couldn't sit on your pew. Right. They couldn't come on your street unless they announced themselves. Yeah. Unclean. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah. Unclean. Yes, yeah, sir. Unclean. All right. This was their condition. But they saw Jesus. Yeah. They saw Jesus. Yes, sir. A thankful heart, first of all, seeks after Jesus. Yes. Amen. 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 
Amen. I don't know what you're seeking today. Yes, right, sir. Man. I don't know what you have gone through these past two years. All right. But I found myself seeking the Lord Jesus just a little bit more. Amen. 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 Jesus. Jesus. Have mercy. Amen. Oh, me. Yes, Lord. Yes, sir. Jesus. Yes, sir. All right. Have mercy. Yes. They begin to cry out. Yes. Unto the Lord. Amen. You know, I once knew a man who he had a thriving business. All right. He had a beautiful wife and a beautiful family. Had money, had position. He had it going on. All right. He even had a great position in the church. He was a leader in church. But he took his eyes off of the Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And he got caught up. And he started cheating on his beautiful wife okay. with Whoopi Goldberg. <laughs> this woman was rough. I don't know what he saw in this woman, but he liked the woman. So he lost his wife. He lost his children. He lost his position in church. He lost his business. He lost his relationship to God. Amen. And I remember I, I ran into him one day. And I said, Brother, how you doing? I'm making it. I said, Brother, won't you get right with the Lord? He says, I ain't hurting enough. Amen. Amen. Good God, my. But that's just like some of us. Boy, no, no. We are hurting. We are going through. But yet pride keeps us out. Keeps us from crying out to the Lord. Right. Our pride keeps us from seeking God. Yes, right. The yes, one that can help us. Yes. How long do you want to stay in your mess? How long do you want to stay in your situation? My Bible says seek the Lord. While he may be found, yes, call upon his name while he is near. Amen. Amen. Are you thankful this morning? I'm thankful. A thankful heart seeks after Jesus, but also a thankful heart has faith in Jesus. Look at here in verse 14. It says, and when he saw them, he said unto them, go and show yourselves unto the priests. And it came to pass that as they went, they were cleansed. Mm -hmm. God knew what they wanted. Yes, they didn't even ask to have to ask. That's right. Amen. Amen. Before you even go down on your knees, you know God already you know. knows. Yes, sir, God. Yes, sir, already knows. But you got a part to play. Yeah. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. You see, faith is a key that unlocks. Yes, sir. The door. Yeah. All right. Amen. The Bible says, "Be ye doers of the word, and not hearers only, right. deceiving." Your own selves. Amen. We want to get an A. Then you got to study. All right, then. Come on. We want to get the degree. But you got to go to class. <laughs> Great. Great. We want the paycheck. And the work. But then you got to go to work. Yeah, we yeah. want God to act in our lives. Yeah, yeah. but you. Yeah. Then we gotta act on our faith. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You don't want to do that. Yes, sir. They acted on 
their faith. He told them to go and they went. Amen. On their way. And along the way. Yes, sir. Didn't even get there. Praise uh -huh. God. Along the way. Yes, sir. Yeah. They were healed. Along the way. They were cleansed. God had blessed them. He had did for them what nobody else could do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> and that's what he can do for you. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. yes sir. Verse 15. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, yeah. he turned back and with a loud voice, he glorified God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He began to praise God. Yes, sir. God had healed him. God had made him whole. God had made him complete. Yes, sir. And he stopped. And he took the time yeah. Yeah. to go back. Yeah. Yes, sir. Amen. Yeah. Woo. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. He didn't follow the crowd. Mm -hmm. He didn't go along with the group. All right now. He stood out among himself. And he went to the master. And he fell down at his feet. And he began to praise him. Amen. Are you like the nine? Amen. All right. Amen. Or are you the one? Yes, All right. Come on. All right. Yes, sir. You see, some of us, we want the blessings of God. Yeah. But we don't want God. Amen. Right. Amen. Amen. We want his gifts. Yes, sir. Yeah. But we don't want the gift giver. Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. We want to go to heaven. Yeah. But we don't want to serve him. Amen. Yeah. Amen. We want God to bless us. Yeah. But we can't even get logged on Zoom. Amen. Amen. Preach, boy. Preach. <laughs> yes, sir, Doc. Amen. Are you thankful this morning? Yes, Lord. Thank you. Are you really thankful Amen. this morning? Has God done anything for you? Yes. If he has, you ought to praise him. Yes. If he put food on your table, yes. you ought to praise him. Yes, You are to Amen. praise him. Amen. If you're allowed to go in the hospital and come out of the Amen. hospital, Amen. you are to praise. Yes, to find out that God is able, sometimes he has to put you in a spot for you to realize that you are able. That's it, man. God is able. That's it. If you had not lost your job, mm. come on now. You would know him as a Ooh. provider. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you hadn't got sick, yes, sir. Yes, sir. you would know him as a yes, healer. Yes, if you wasn't never broke, you would know him as a way maker. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you were never lost. Yes, sir. Woo. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. You wouldn't know how to be fair. Yes, sir. If he never showed you how bad you were, Amen. then you would have never turned Amen. to him. Amen. Are you thankful yes, this morning? Are you grateful for what God has done for you? Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. 
I'm thankful this yes. morning. Yes. I am grateful this yes. morning. Yes. I am so glad to see your smiling faces. Yes. I'm so glad to be here today. Amen. I'm grateful Glory. and I'm thankful. Yes. Amen. Let us pray. And Father, we thank you for your word that has gone forth. Yes, yes. Lord. We thank you, Lord, for blessing us today. Yes. Thank you, Father. I pray that we would develop a thankful heart yes. towards you. Because had not been for you on our side, yes. where would we be? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Had not you protected us, we'd probably be in our grave. Father, right now, Lord, we thank you, Lord, for all that you have done, all that you have said, and all that you're going to do. And Father, we give you the glory, we give you the honor, and we give you the praise today. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Amen. 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 Thank you, Amen. Thank you, Pastor Reverend Hardaway. Church, say amen. amen. What an appropriate message. Amen. And after all we've been through, somebody in here ought to be thankful. Amen. Over 500 million people dead. Yes, Lord. And we're still here. Thank you, Lord. Now, it's not saying we're not going to die, but we ain't dead yet. Praise God. Thank you, Pastor. That was a wonderful message. Showing us that there are more people who are ungrateful yes, sir. for the things he does for us in this world. And there's only one out of ten that showed enough thankful for what God has done for us. But I want you to know if you're here today, God is great at teaching us how to be thankful. If you don't know Christ in the pardon of your sins, if you wake up every day thinking that someone owes you something, thinking that uh, uh, you got where you are all by yourself, thinking that, you know, there's no hope, thinking that that, that things are not going to get any better. Going, yes, to, going to bed, work, worrying about things, and oh, waking up, uh, you, it can yes. all be over. Yes. All you have to do is accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, the one who came and lived and suffered and died, and God raised him on the third day. He died for the sins of the world, but more importantly, he died just. For you. And if you're here today, all you have to do is just come. Social distancing and mass, just come. Amen. We'll work this thing out. God wants no one to perish. But you got to be honest with yourself. You got to be honest that you're not right. Yes, Lord. God is. You have to be honest that nothing you do is pleasing to God. When it's outside of this world. If you're here today, will you come? We're gonna die. May not be from COVID. Come on. May not be from falling off a ladder. <laughs> we leave it here. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. When ladder gets you, COVID gets you, jet, it doesn't matter. Yes, but the Bible says that if you die in Christ, yes. it is better to be dead in the body yes, than to be alive on earth. Yes. To die is our gain, yes. not our loss. Woo. It's hard to see that from where I'm standing, but that's what he said. Yes, in my faith, I believe it. Come on. Will you come? As the choir sings. So good. Yes, sir.
room for whosoever will. And let us leave this day more thankful than we came. God bless you. We love you.